What's up, everybody? This is basically my mini pump action rainbow blaster. I have a very simple RSCB right on the top with some clear PVC so you can see all the shots. Um, it's only a half draw, so it's only about three inches of draw or so with all your standard rainbow accoutrements. Have the skirt seal here, half of a K25, and your anti-kinking mechanism, which I think really should be standard on all rainbows at this point. Um, it's the only thing I found that allows for a consistent lock on an omnidirectional piston lock. The whole idea behind this was I wanted to be able to demonstrate homemade power, basically, at DartCon. So over the course of, I think, 24 hours, I just made this guy up real quick. It's actually designed for stock storeboard darts. It doesn't seem to like suction tip darts, but I guess you can't win them all. I think that has more to do with my barrel setup. But if we tried this out, it goes absolutely crazy. Not accurate at all. It will launch darts extremely quickly, but it has no accuracy whatsoever. I've noticed this with most of the homemade blasters, that there's just so much energy, and these darts are so unstable at higher speeds, they will just spiral out of control. My barrel here is just Schedule 80 uh, PVC, so it is a fatter wall PVC, so you get a slightly tighter fit on the darts. And to hold the darts in place, I actually just put a little lip of one half inch C PVC. I don't know if you could see it there. And that basically just stops it. I reamed it out a bit so it's about half an inch inner diameter. So it just creates just enough friction where the dart isn't going to slide out when you tip the thing down, since that's how the RSCB works. Other than that, we have a pretty standard rainbow pump. Because it's clear, I might as well show you kind of the operation of it. If you ignore this top piece here, you can see how this actually works. We have a piston with its skirt seal there. I push it back and you'll see this guy here is going to drop out, which is going to catch inside of that little notch right there. The pump has a plate on the back which pushes against this plate and this plate here is connected to the piston rod. So when the pump pumps back, you are effectively just pushing this guy back right here. Very simple design, as you can see. I didn't really refine the handle too much. I use clear PVC, which you shouldn't do structurally, even though I did here. And I just integrated the RSCB into the stock because, I don't know, I thought it looked cool and kept a slightly lower profile. So people seem to really enjoyed this at, at DartCon. I'm very pleased with it, and uh, I may just keep it as a demonstrative blaster. It really kind of does all the things I wanted to do. It hits all the marks just for demonstrating how rainbows kind of work. Thanks for watching everybody. This was a fun quick little build that I kind of just made on the fly before End War and uh, everybody seemed to like it. I'm really happy about that. So thanks for watching guys. Like, comment, subscribe if you liked it and uh, I'll see you soon. Next objective, one star.